Hello and welcome to another video for Minus Touch Toys, Games and Collectibles. And today we're looking at the 2017 release by Hasbro from their Mighty Mugs series of action figures. Uh, now these action figures were the ones that had the rotatable heads. So you could press the head and they would turn round and you'd have a different image on the face. Um, and this particular one we're looking at today is of Chewbacca. And it is from the last Jedi movie, as he appeared in the last Jedi movie. Okay, so this is the um, container it comes in. And it says Star Wars, Mighty Mugs, Chewbacca, ages 6 plus, And you've got the Disney and the Hasbro label. And at the top, um, if I just come out a little bit, you can see that there are arrows pointing to the top. And they're pointing to the top of his head. But we come to that in a moment. I'm just going to turn the... Uh, box around and so on the back doesn't really give you much information just tells you the uh, 2017 all rights reserved it's the all the copyright information there uh, made in China and you've got all the logos at the bottom um, and it says mighty mugs has bro.com star wars and star wars.com you've got the barcode um, and the item number at the bottom. We've got the Mighty Mugs logo and Hasbro logo and a Star Wars logo. Okay, so that is the, the back. So let's just, is there anything on the side? No, it's just all, um, just warning information on the side. And is it the same on the other side? Oh, well, on the other side, it says Chewbacca, Chewbacca, and it is Star Wars number two which is number two in the series of these Mighty Mugs. I'm not quite sure how many of them were produced, um, but we've had, or we've got quite a few in stock, different ones in stock, and um, we've had quite a few before. So I know we've had Ray, we've had Kylo Ren, we've had Han Solo, we've had Luke Skywalker. Um, so we've got Chewbacca now. I think we've had, yeah, we've had Darth Vader as well. Um, anyway, so let's just pull this forward. So there you can see, Chewbacca, um, and if you put my finger in the top there and press his head, you can see the head rotates. And there you can see him growling or roaring. Uh, and there you can see him in like an uh, uh position, uh, expression. It's, let's just say, huh? What are you talking about? Uh, and then back to his solemn face going, mm, yes, okay, thank you very much. And then to scare people off, rawr, the roar of Chewbacca. Um, and again back to his what what are you talking about and then back to his solemn face okay so that's how the, the mighty mugs work now size wise uh we are looking at about uh 12 just under 12 centimeters in height just trying to get this where you don't get a reflection um so 12 centimeters in height and the head is obviously the biggest part so we're looking at a seven centimeter um width and depth wise, we are looking at about six centimeters deep. So that is the size of the figure. They're not huge figures. Um, and they wasn't, it wasn't a massively popular line. Um, Hasbro released them um, because it was something different, something that I hadn't seen before, I believe. Um, and yeah, they did, they did a, a fairly okay with them, but I wouldn't say they were the best sellers. Um, only a, a smaller quantity was produced and, and sold. Um, they were on the shelves in, the, in a lot of the toy shops for a very long time before being sold out. So they really wasn't, the um, sales really wasn't as what was hoped. Um, but when that happens, it makes them collectible and sought after. Um, so, you know, we're talking seven years on now since these were released. Um, so they, they were only on the shelf for about a year or so before the line was axed. Um, so, yeah, but now, obviously, yeah, they are collectible. Um, and there's a lot of people that are looking for different ones of these. Uh, as I say, I can't remember how many were produced in overall, but I think we've had about seven or eight different ones in stock at any one time. Um, but difficult to find these days, especially in this mint unopened condition. But as usual, we at Minus Touch have managed to find a few. And they're currently available to purchase on the Midas Touch website, which you can get to quite simply by clicking the link below. It will take you straight to the website, or you're about 
uh, where you will be able to find this <laughs> and many other vintage Star Wars items, even though this one's not that vintage. Um, and many other vintage toys games to get it was come to that. There's over 10,000 products currently available on the website for you to view and purchase at your leisure. And also, don't forget to hit the subscribe button because we are uploading videos for every new item that goes into the website. There will be something for everybody, and I am absolutely positive you're not going to want to miss this. Because we literally have thousands and thousands of new items which we're shooting videos for and uploading on a daily basis. So if there is something in particular you are looking for, something old that you've never been able to find, something quirky you might want to buy for a friend, or maybe just something from your childhood that you'd like to own again to help you recuperate those long lost childhood memories. Well, stay tuned, keep watching, because you never know that next item we upload could be that item you've been looking for. Okay, that is it for me on this particular item. I hope you've enjoyed this very short video. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you again soon.